I didn't expect you to leave after the two weeks. You never picked my calls and neither did you return them. Sorry I ran away from you without any explanation. I had a bad experience with my ex-boyfriend. I needed time alone to clear my head. You left me in a limbo. I didn't know what was going on. I was hurt. Sorry to hurt you is not my intention. However, our two weeks deal is over. Yes, I'm aware of that. But did you get the balance as I promised? Oh, that. Yes, I did. Sorry, I never called. I should have. It's okay. Well, uh, I didn't think I'll see myself sitting here asking you to be my girlfriend. Especially knowing that you broke off with your boyfriend. The two weeks I spent with you were the best moments of my life. Where do I stand now with you? Look, Andrew, you are a nice guy. And every girl would die to be your girlfriend. But right now, I don't think I'm ready for any relationship. I'm not ready for this. I'm scared. What are you scared of? Have I not proven myself? Yes, you have. So was my ex until I caught him with one of my bosom friends. Who is this stupid ex of yours? Huh? He must be very stupid to cheat on you. Look, Mandy, I will never treat you that way. I need you in my life. I can't live without you. Can't you see? Don't give me any excuses. Please, please, I'm, I'm, I'm not ready for this. I need time. Time? What time are you talking about? Don't tell me the two weeks that we spent together means nothing to you. Are you that mean? No, I'm not. It's just that... Okay. I'll be your girlfriend. Say that again. Say that again. I said... <laughs> I'll be your girlfriend. That's what I'm talking about. Come here. Mm. You know what? What? I want you to move in with me. Oh, mm, 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 mm. no, 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 no. Andrew, mm. don't do this. Don't do this, please. What? I just agreed to be your girlfriend. We're not married yet. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You want marriage? You want to be married? Look, I will give you the best wedding mm, ever. Okay, come here. No, no, no. What? That's not what I'm talking about. Listen, we, we, we've spent two weeks together of intimacy. I mean, we need time to discuss this. Marriage is not a, a Can't you see clip. how desperate I am to have you? This man right here, he's so desperate. Oh, you want me to show you how desperate I am? You want me to show you how desperate I am? You want me to show you? Okay, now let's do this. Let's do this. I'm taking you back there to let you know. Babe. Yes? It's been a while I heard you talk about your proposed cosmetic business. What happened? Yeah, that's because my ex cancelled the idea. He feels it's too capital intensive. Mm. Right now, I really do not know what to do. Mm. But come on. You are one of the top guys in the corporate business world here in Nigeria. So you should have an idea. What do you think I should do? Well, I actually loved your idea, but if you're giving me the permission to come up with something for you, sure, I'll gladly do that. Baby, come on. I'm giving you the permission. Please do. Got it. I will. Okay? okay. Thank you. You're welcome. 
Right now, I have things to do tomorrow. I need to sleep. Okay. okay. Come to bed. <clears throat> but I'm in bed. No, you're not. Look, from now till forever, my body is your bed. So, come. <laughs> okay. Come here. <laughs> Sleepy head. Good morning. What's the time? You're dressed already. Yes. Oh my god, and I've not made breakfast. Uh, uh, no, no, no. Don't worry about it. You seem very tired. I will eat when I get to the office, okay? <laughs> Hell no, there's no way I would let you leave this house with empty stomach. My mother trained me well. I like. Hello, Kelly. Good morning. Oh, forgive me. I left my phone in the living room. Where are you now? Don't worry. I'll make it up to you, okay? I'll see you this evening. I said I'll see you this evening. <laughs> Bad boy, I know you would. <laughs> All right, then, catch ya. Kiss, kiss. You like? Baby, enjoy your Take meal. It. a lot of things to do today. so much. I love you too. You are an epitome of beauty. Whenever I look at you, the, your beauty makes my hair stand. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously, looking at you, 
alone can make any man go out of this world. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Oh. You're beautiful. Thank you. You are the best thing that is happening to me. And you will continue to be the best because with you, my life is complete. Hmm. I love you. <laughs> I love you too. You are so good with words, trust me. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Um, baby. Yes, love. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Come on, you're free. What is it? Um. Have you ever dated Lizzie? Or are you guys dating? Lizzie? Come on, no. No, not at all. We've not. We've not even thought of, thought of that. Lizzie has been my friend for 15 years now. I've known her for 15 years now. She has been my confidant. In fact, Whenever I'm finding something difficult or I want an advice, I get it from her. That's right. And when she wants to, she gets from me. So we've not thought of dating, no? We've not. Okay, Why do you ask? because I'm a little bit confused how she could allow you ask me out. Yeah, it's no more. It's no more, I think, because she wants my happiness and she believes that you are the only person that can make me happy. Mm. Don't you think she likes you and would want you to be a lover? No, I don't think so because I I know her man. Oh, oh okay. Okay, that's fine then. Don't tell me you're jealous, babe. I'm just curious. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> not. Babe. It's okay. I'm just kidding. So, the important thing here now is that you're sitting with me, and I am smiling, talking, enjoying this damn show. Right. Yes. Monday, I love you. I love you too. You're the best. I know. Thank you. <laughs> Lest I forget, baby. Tell me, how are you planning to spend the rest of your day? Oh, my day. Uh -huh. I plan to spend my day. Wait. What? <laughs> oh my God. Seriously, you mean you want us to stay together all through today? Yes, I'm all yours, baby. Oh, I'm happy. I'm happy for that. Please, I will not be bored. Yeah, you won't we'll, be bored. We'll be together all through today. We'll cook together. I'll show you that I can cook too. Mm-hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. You don't believe it? I do. Sure? <laughs> yes. I'll cook better than you. Okay. We'll yeah, see. let's I forget. I... Guess. I'm not good at guessing. Try, yes. baby. I'm not good at guessing, for real. Fine, I'll tell you. I'll be going on vacation in Spain. Mm. Okay. No problem. Really? Is that all you want you say? No problem. I'll miss you. Are you sure? Of course. You miss me. I will miss you. Okay. Ah, that was actually what I was waiting to hear from you. No, you're not gonna miss me. But rather. We'll go together. Wait. 
Yes. Did I just hear you say something? I said, this beautiful dancer sitting there before me is going to spend with me. <laughs> <laughs> There's no help. Hello, Nne. No, I'm fine. I am no more sick. How do I go, Mumma? Oh, God will bless you for me. Adam. <laughs> Mama, thank God I've been able to reach you. Uh -uh. Because of you, I keep calling a maker. Mama, why are you not taking your calls? Oh. No, I'm sorry, oh. I'm very sorry. You know, it is because of the drugs I'm taking. I thought you said, I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm sorry. And that time, I will not know where I dropped my phone. Ah, Mama, it's a small phone now. Tie it on your wrapper. Or put it in your purse. Eh? Just imagine, I've not been able to talk to you since, since I left the village. It's not fair now, Mama. I'm sorry. No, yo, yo. I'm in I'm sorry, oh. So, how are you and the man we are working for? Mama, I'm doing fine. City is fine. As for that rich man, I don't work with him again. Ah, ah. Oh, Guinea man. What happened? <laughs> Mama, don't worry. I work with richer men now. <laughs> Mama, with my current situation now, <laughs> you will really know that poverty has left our lives. Oh. Eh, hey, what up, guy? What up, guy? Oh, yeah, but one, but one. That look, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, with you, I'm seeing it now. I'll soon go to Obodo Ibo. <laughs> Obodo Ibo? You? Abroad? Hey, <laughs> hey! Eh? Matter is closed. Amen. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. And hey, Mama, please, always be with your phone, eh? And take your drugs, please, so that I can be able to reach you, you know? Oh, no. Okay, I'm going to take care, oh. Call you later. Be with your phone, no. I don't want to call a maker again all the time because I want to talk to you, please. Bye-bye, oh. Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs> My daughter. Hey! My love. Sweetheart. is an understatement baby i want you to enjoy your life oh make sure you enjoy it in marbella oh. have you heard of marbella 
Yes, yes, yes. In I, Spain? Yes, I am. I will make sure you lodge in one of the best resorts in Spain. Oh, baby. You enjoy Europe. Oh, baby, you just, you just want to spoil me. Kill me, baby. <laughs> Kill me, baby. Oh, my God, baby. Yes, ma'am. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so I don't get it. I gave you everything. I gave you things that you didn't ask for. Why can't you spend the whole week to ourselves? Baby, I love you so much and I'm sorry I have not spent a lot of time with you. I didn't mean to. Just that I have a lot of projects going on right what now. What projects are you talking about? Huh? Tell me, what projects are you talking about? The idea I gave you, you've done nothing about it. You're telling me you, you're working on a lot of projects. Mandy, are, are you seeing another man? Why are you saying this to me? Why are you saying all this? Is it because I told you I'm, I'm, I'm to go to Spain with my aunt? Is that why you're saying this? You're going to Spain? And where's that even coming from? You asked me to buy you a small apartment, which I have, and suddenly you have to go to Spain with your auntie. Please, please stop this. Stop this. Don't make me look like a liar. I told you some months ago that I would be going to Spain, didn't I? Yes, you did, but you came back telling me that that trip was cancelled. Instead, you pleaded with me to get you a small apartment, which I have. Mandy, what are you not telling me? Well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I hurt you. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry, but... Listen. I can stay back if you don't want me to go for this trip. I can stay and take care of you. But I would love to go. I will. If my father had accepted us, all this wouldn't be happening. I wouldn't even think of going to Spain with my aunt. This is all because of my father, the former governor. Hey, it's it's okay. It's okay. It's fine. It's okay. It's fine. Um, I know how much this means to you, and I don't want to deny you the chance. My problem is we've been dating for some time now, and I still don't feel fully accepted. Baby, I understand, but don't worry. When I get back from Spain, you'll be the one begging me to leave your side. You promise? But you're sleeping here tonight. And you have to make me that special local soup you promised. Okay. I will. Anything for you. Thank you, baby. Hmm. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? What are you thinking? You know what I'm thinking. You don't look your best. Hey, talk to me, what is it? Surprisingly, he never asked what happened with my boyfriend. Yes, um, I deliberately didn't ask. Actually, I wanted you to leave him for me. When I proposed, you didn't say anything about him, so I figured you're all mine. 
Well, you're right. You see, like I said before, I never thought I would fall in love. When you proposed, I said yes. I can't wait to be your wife. <laughs> wait. Are you serious? So I... I can go and see your people? Exactly. Baby, I have overcome my fear of being married. And baby... I can't wait to be your wife. Hi babe, where are you? You're taking so much time. Everything is set. We're waiting for you and your people. Where are you? I didn't know you were such a bad person. What haven't I done to prove my love? You know, I don't think I can spend the rest of my life with a liar and a dishonest person like you. I thought you loved me. Little did I know that you were just a play actor after my money. Now you listen to me. I am very aware of all your escapades with men. I don't understand. Baby, what are you talking about? Does Billy G, Kelly, Philip and Stephen ring a bell? <laughs> Baby, who is feeding you with all these lies? Who is feeding you with all these lies? Baby. Happy married life, Amaka Obiora Okochi. Hello, Mandy. Why is everywhere quiet? There's, there's no sound of music or... How, how did the marriage ceremony go? I, I guess um, Andrew listens to my advice, right? It will never be well with you. You are a devil. It will never be well with you. You are a woman sheep clothing. You are a devil. I promise you it will never be well with you. <coughs> so if you call me a devil, what would you call yourself? Hmm? Well, I just called to tell you congratulations on, uh, should I say, a successful marriage. Or should I say yet yeah, to be successful marriage? I don't know, but I just got to know, of course, how the whole thing went. Hmm? God will judge you! God will judge you! It will never be well with you! It will never be well with you! God will judge you! God will judge you! <laughs> My girl. Describe this your love. 
This your love She has money in mind